Despite a recent trampoline injury to her finger, the Princess of Wales showed her true sportsmanship spirit when she took to the court for a game of wheelchair rugby. Speaking to a team member before heading on the court, Kate said, I'm worried about my finger, but willing to try, and clearly a natural at the sport. Her injury didn't hold her back, and she quickly scored a try. Her participation in the game was part of a visit to the Alm Sports Center in Hull, where she met with players from the Leeds Rhinos Foundation Wheelchair Rugby League team. Wheelchair rugby is a fast-paced and physical sport that is played by people of all abilities. It is a great way to stay active and have fun, and it also helps to promote inclusion and diversity. Kate's visit to the Alm Sports Center was a great way to show her support for wheelchair rugby and for people with disabilities. It also sent a positive message about the importance of sportsmanship and perseverance. In addition to her wheelchair rugby match, Kate also met with other athletes and coaches at the Alm Sports Center. She learned about the different sports that are offered at the center and the important role that it plays in the community. Kate's visit to the Alm Sports Center was a reminder of her commitment to promoting sport and physical activity for people of all ages and abilities. It also showed her support for people with disabilities and her commitment to inclusion and diversity. Kate's resilience and sportsmanship hates decision to participate in the wheelchair rugby match despite her finger injury is a testament to her resilience and sportsmanship spirit. It is also a reminder that people with disabilities are just as capable as anyone else of participating in sports and other activities. Kate's example is an inspiration to us all. It shows us that it is important to persevere in the face of challenges and to never give up on our dreams. It also reminds us that sports can be a powerful force for good, bringing people together and promoting inclusion and diversity.